I'm in the lampshade section. Now you guys, these lampshades are a dollar and you may be thinking like, what am I going to do with that? There's all these different ones to choose from, but what I'm gonna do, I found this one and doesn't this look like a base to an amazing tray? I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna look for a plate at the thrift store, combine them and see what I can make. Another idea I have, these light fixtures, there's so many at the restore and they sell them for really cheap. This light fixture I think would be perfect. Imagine it, you guys. I'm gonna take off all the hardware, flip it over, paint it. It's gonna be, look so nice on my coffee table. All right, you guys, this is Delaney. I'm coming to pick up this lamp that we just showed you guys, or this light fixture that we just showed you guys. Liz actually talked down the price, so we're gonna be getting this for, I think it was 75% off of the original price, so we're gonna be getting this for a way better discount. I'm really excited about this light fixture. So I started by disassembling it. I didn't know how tricky that would be, but honestly, it was so easy. I just had to pull off this center portion and then the top portion just came right off. Now I'm left with this huge bowl that's gonna look so great on my coffee table. I first had to clean it up, you guys. It was really dirty, so I just used a wet paper towel and cleaned it off. I decided to spray paint this piece and I wanted it to have kind of like a textured look. So I had this multi-texture outdoor spray paint in my collection. It's this kind of tan color, but it has some dimension to it. So I started by spraying the back of it, let that dry. I flipped it over and then I did two coats on the front side. Once everything had a chance to dry, I'm gonna come back in with Rub and Buff. This is a gold Rub and Buff color, and it's kind of more of a rose gold color. I'm gonna put that with a foam brush along the edges. I wanted to mute that down a little bit, so I used a second, more antique gold color on top of the rose gold. Now I had to show you guys how I styled this piece on my coffee table. So I put it in the middle of my coffee table. I added in some candles as well as this air plant. This is actually from Hobby Lobby and I love how big and bold it is. Here's how this light fixture coffee table bowl turned out. Hey guys, I'm Liz and you're watching my second DIY channel where I post daily DIY videos. You may be familiar with my main channel, Liz Fibwick DIY, but I'm glad that you found me over here on my second channel. Make sure that you're subscribed so you just get notified every day when I post our daily DIY video.